Okay, here's the thing. When we first meet the Wicked Witch of the West in The Wizard of Oz, she's already middle-aged. And I'm wondering, was she born that way? I mean, can you picture her there in the cradle, circled by the flying monkeys all singing, oh e o oh -e o Or did she, like, become the Wicked Witch of the West gradually over time? And for this analogy to work, we have to imagine that anybody gets to be the Wicked Witch of the West, that it's general neutral. So you're growing up and you're mean to people and you get this spritz of Wicked Witch of the West stank. And any particular spritz doesn't smell that bad, so you don't notice. But this is really stinky stuff. And so you're growing up, you're mean to people and you get the spritz and you get the spritz and... Eventually, your friends, they take you aside and go, you know, dude, you're really starting to get a stank about you. And you're all like, oh, no, I, that's not a stank. What you smell, now that's the smell of power. Now that's the smell of righteousness. And you keep right on trucking with it because you think it's good for you. And, it, you know, careers go the way careers go, and you start to work, but then you're in a supervisory position, and then you're supervising a bunch of people, and you're nasty to all of them. You're bitch slapping this person, you're bitch slapping that person. And you overhear people talking in the lunchroom. You know, the one person's like, Oh, I have the worst boss in the entire world. And the other person's like, Dude, you got nothing. I actually work for the Wicked Witch of the West. And you think to yourself, ah, now that's the sound of respect. And you keep right on going. And so one day an employee screws up. I mean, you know, employees, they screw up. And you're bitch slapping this person. You're telling them, you frickin' asshole this and you frickin' asshole that. And they throw a water balloon at you. Water balloon. And you're all like, I'm melting, I'm melting, what's happening to me? And they're all like, dude, we've been telling you for years that you're the Wicked Witch of the West. How did you think this was going to end? Now that's karma.